Um, follow your dreams. Yeah. yeah. What's up, Scorpio? Welcome to your February uh, 2024 reading. This is going to be a really quick reading. Um, like and subscribe because I will be doing a lot more readings for you, Scorpio, here in my channel. I also do free tarot readings on Fridays or throughout the weekend. So if you do want to get a reading from me or you want me to uh, answer your question with yes or no or more in depth um, specific um, information for you, please like and hit the notification bell. It's going to help me out. And plus, again, you might get a, uh, you know free reading for me so um and then come hang out everybody in my channel is very positive so we encourage each other to um evolve and transform here we go let's see scorpio what's in the center of your reading here okay we have a connection maybe a decision uh um okay and then let's see here oh wow all right scorpio <laughs> all right you can stop showing off now scorpio psych <laughs> um what's in the future for you scorpio perfect wow amazing i have this very good um energy for you scorpio um <clears throat> i think sagittarius got a pretty good reading so far i think it, it has been one of the best readings so far for Sagittarius but um I mean you coming up here and you're all these cards are falling out and letting you know that what's happening here in February um so what's at the center of your um of your reading here is the lovers the lovers is obviously a connection um regarding love it's a soulmate connection i don't believe in twin flames but if you want to call it a twin flame card then that's all up to you um lovers uh is a soulmate someone from maybe that you dealt with in the previous life um and or somebody who just feels very very connected to you from the soul and the mind and the body so the connection just flows the energy is good you feel great they feel great about it you know it's it's love overall right um everything's perfect with this lovers okay now where we coming from is the hierophant so the hierophant um speaks to us about you know maybe you could have been you know the past could have been for you where you stuck to faith you connected with god um there was prayers there was meditation done there was um knowledge um books read right the the hierophant is it has the image of a pope but it's a person that has a lot of wisdom and information regarding spirituality or even just um you know um religion on itself but it's it's also somebody who studies you know maybe you were going to school maybe you started school or something like that maybe there's a counselor here helping you um it's also the image of um to me sometimes it's also the image of a um um a counselor or a um like a therapist right um and someone who helps you uh move forward and grow and break down what's going on you know if you do so if you do suffer from depression depression i can't even speak why if you do suffer from depression it could also be a doctor it's just somebody that has a lot of information and can help you out notice how he has the keys um he has the keys here at the bottom and he's holding this big old thing that looks like a gigantic i don't know key or whatever but this person has a lot of information or if this is you i feel like you've been studying you've been evolving you your you know um w awakening process has started has begun or there was a lot of praying there was a lot of um I don't know connect them with god so you can succeed okay there was maybe a period where you just wanted to find out okay the v is also number five so it's also changes or so information that will change your life okay so somebody who helps you with information to change your life 
in a positive very very positive way okay um <laughs> so that was your past what's coming up in your future is the empress is uh growth is um pregnancy is um a new person entering your life um someone positive as well it's also the uh the empress is a very mature nurturing um energy motherly like so it could be that you're going into um this energy of being very caring to your friends um you know co-workers and just anybody around you but it could also be like there's you know even if you're a female scorpio and you know um it could also be that you're 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 fighting out um you're you're con connecting to a male person that has you know that is very caring towards you or you want to care for this person maybe you want to be their wife or something like that maybe you know this person wants to claim you scorpio and put a ring on it and and you know but i feel like everything has to do with uh with um a love connection here um the lovers again is a, a love connection but it could also be a relationship i mean a um decision sorry about that a decision a very important decision that um that is very important to you and it connects down to your soul okay now what we have grounding you is the fool so the fool is um taking the leap of faith is um saying yes to anybody that comes um your way especially to this very special person if this is about a relationship you're like yes i want to connect with this person i want to marry this person i want to be with this person yes i love this person this is my person blah 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 you know if they say jump i'll jump um and i'm trusting the universe i'm trusting god this is the person they sent me for me and your head over heels whether you're a man or a woman here um again because this is our grounding energy um scorpio i want to say be careful because the fool does not think the fool does not see reality the fool just takes that leap of faith um the fool feels lucky and you know she jumps out of the cliff here and she hopes that god is gonna you know um kind of cushioning the fall or she's gonna land on her feet so it's a very careless so watch out with how you do things um in february because you might make a mistake that could be very difficult for you anyways what's going on in your headspace what's going on in your mind is the sun baby um the sun is here to let you know that you have a clear um you have a clear head you are you know you're committed um you have this idea and you're f fixated on it you have this mentality and it's very positive you have a lot of hope and you're planning for the future with everything it's like you're putting pretty much <laughs> i don't know why i'm saying this it's like you're putting this your entire all on this connection or on this decision again if it's not a connection scorpio it's definitely a decision of um it could be career um it could be it could be career for some of y'all okay if it's not love related um and then you feel like in your head you feel like you already have this connection in your head you feel very confident um very positive when it comes to pretty much the entire february very very positive here i feel like um at the bottom of the deck we have the sand of pentacles so i feel like we reached a level a certain level in our life where we got to change something to be able to get more back seven of pentacles here is this person looking at the you know crops here at the garden and and everything that they've worked for because they looked at they're looking back to see that maybe they can do better or for next uh season what is it that they gotta do to even gain more did the right mixture of you know attention information um physical work and all that um give the results they wanted right so it's like looking back at your crops or looking back at everything that you did and kind of perfecting the um 
the recipe <laughs> and going back and doing things because now you want to get better now you want to change things up a little bit so it's like a change of vibration it's like hold like stopping suddenly and saying okay you know i've been doing this for years and i've been getting the same result it's it's now time for me the scorpio to um change something and get something different in return i know the right mixture to get a consistent you know seven of pentacles here but i have an idea that if i add a little bit more elbow grease to blah 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 then i'll be able to get in you know nine of pentacles instead of a seven right and I, if you know tarot then the nine of pentacles is the abundance is where you have a lot of you know resources and or financial stability here where you're independent right so that was your reading it was really short it, it's it's sweet because i mean there's a lot of positivity here especially in the future with this um empress is like yeah watch out for those of you who are you know going on valentine's day uh dates here um wear protection because this is a, a card of pregnancy so some of you scorpions are also giving um birth or just you guys are just feeling the if you're pregnant if a scorpio here is pregnant then you're feeling um i don't know like you're feeling the baby move it feels good um the pregnancy feels great um it's a beautiful thing especially with the fool here you know and the sun it's a beautiful thing i feel like when you feel your baby move you just can't wait you have a lot of love you want to nurture your baby so yeah for the for all of those uh, scorpios that are pregnant right now i feel like the experience of being pregnant it's 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 a little not necessarily scary but it's it's just fascinating you and and it's like giving you a, a lot of happiness right now you're just excited you know you're you're you just cannot wait to see your child okay congrats if you are pregnant um take care of yourself take care of your child um again like and subscribe to get more um of my readings and or um if you want to get a free ring for me again fridays and through the weekend i do go live and i talk to people so hit the notification bell thank you so much for being a really great supporter i believe in you scorpio and i believe in everything you can do and you're very important for um the world so keep in flow of your energy thank you so much if you can't fly run if you can't run walk if you can't walk crawl but by all means keep moving <laughs>